Hi, good morning. Welcome to Business. My name is Daryl Kwao. The Food and Beverage Association of Ghana is concerned about the rate at which imported raw materials are taking over the local market. According to General Secretary of the Association, Sam Agri, more support should be given to local researchers to aid in reducing imports. He spoke to Joy Business at the second edition of the Agritech West Africa exhibition. West Africa, with food and beverage and food park tech Ghana exhibition, covers the entire value chain of our culture industry under one roof with about 100 companies exhibiting from Ghana and beyond. According to the Beverage Association of Ghana, more investment is needed in technology. How it is now, technology um, is evolving and therefore as we are doing it, it will get to a time that you expect to change your uh, machinery to um, expand your facility and by expanding you also need uh, higher technology in doing these things. So um, uh, the, the costs of doing all these things comes with borrowing. That is why I said if, if you have to pay a high price for borrowing, therefore you cannot do that. Already when you are bringing in the machinery, they said you have uh, some discount over there at a zero rated uh, value. The uh, relevance in ensuring that uh, we produce more of what is being consumed in Ghana is becoming a life. But then the cost of doing that is very high. And that is why we say government should look at it to ensure that uh, these companies do not suffer. Because uh, wherever they are exporting to, it's also a good destination to set up your facility there. And therefore, we shouldn't give room for them to repack and go to the, that country and produce over there. The second edition of the Agritech West Africa exhibition, along with Food and Beverage Ghana and Food Park Tech Ghana exhibition, shall be held from the 15th to the 17th of March 2023 at the Accra International Conference Center.